guys! I hope you're all doing really well today. So I wanted to film a quick video showing my Ipsy bag again this month because again I was like incredibly impressed with uh, the value. I paid $10 for this stuff and uh, it, it just like blew my mind again. I think the value was like over 50 bucks for everything that I got. So first of all the bag that it came with is like super cute. It says Ipsy on the side here. It's like an adorable like leopard or cheetah print and it's got like a lime, uh, like a lime green to contrast. I just think it's super cute. It just looks adorable. It's like a thick material that's nice and like an inner liner and it's all, like, all waterproof I think or water re water resistant. Like the outside definitely is waterproof. I don't know if the inside is just like water resistant or waterproof but it's um, the kind of like plasticky fabric that you could wash off or wipe off. Anyway I just thought it was super super cute and then um, the thing I like the most in the bag is this um, gel eyeliner. It came with a full size gel eyeliner by this company called Caitlin and um, Caitlin I saw at LA iMats in January and they were selling um, I got some nail stickers from them and I ended up not caring for them very much because they were the nail stickers that are like literally just stickers and I like the ones where the nail stickers are actually nail polish um, so theirs you had to put a top coat on top and then I just didn't think they lasted very well but um, you know that aside like the, the gel eyeliner is actually really nice I put it on my hand and like I could not rub it off it says that it is um, water resistant, smudge proof, 24 hour wearing, safe for sensitive eyes, and there's a built in brush. And the brush isn't bad at all. Um, it's, you can't get like maybe the thinnest line ever out of it, but it's not bad. Um, and so the gel eyeliner is actually a really wearable color. Let me swatch it here for you. It's just a, a really wearable purple color. Just a very, really just typical, not like a bright purple or anything crazy, just really nice. And so I think this thing, I looked it up and it retailed for, I put this on my phone, let me bring it up here. I think it retailed for $21. Yeah, $21. So that in and of itself pays for like two bags because <laughs> the bag is like $10 by itself. So I thought that was really awesome. And then I also got a full size um, lip pencil by Starlux and this is the color Tipsy and so um, I've never heard of Starlux before but the lip pencil is like very very pigmented here let me swatch it for you it's actually really pretty it was easy to put it you can see how easily it goes on it's like a really gorgeous warm pink color and it's pretty bright but what I did is I put it all over my lips and then I put my NYX uh, lip gloss Mega Shine lip gloss in sugar pie on top and it just looked super super gorgeous for summer. It was just like a really fresh color and just really beautiful. Um, and that's like a full size product too so that'll last a ton. And uh, then I got a full size NYX blush. So um, I got uh, this full size blush in Angel which is actually not a color that they carry at my Ulta which is the only place in town uh, where I live that sells NYX. So I was uh, perfectly happy to get this. It's actually a light peachy shade and um, I assume that they gave me this really light shade because of my profile on ipsy.com um, because it says that I'm like a light light skin tone and I don't think this would show up on a skin tone darker than mine um, but this was beautiful like it's kind of like a no-brainer cut to kind of shade it almost reminds me of the type of um, depth of color as uh, Luminoso by Milani which is one of my favorite uh, peach blushes it's a different finish this is more like a shimmery um, well I mean it's like not really really shimmery it's like uh, got a sheen to it like that nice sheeny type glowy glowy look um, but without uh, sparkly particles um, but uh, the Milani one doesn't have quite as much of this. Like this is more powdery than the Milani one. But anyway, I just thought that that was a, a really nice thing. And um, I believe that the eyeliner that I sh or the lip liner that I showed you a minute ago retailed for twelve dollars, and the uh, blush, the NYX blush, retails for seven dollars. And then the last thing that I got in the bag was um, I didn't care for these as much as everything else. This is by. JCat Beauty and it's sort of a cheaper brand. Um, I think this is like a it says it's a sparkling cream sparkling cream palette and it's like sparkly creamy things so I, I wouldn't normally wear these because I'm just not into like sparkly creamy things except for if it was like Halloween maybe or something but um, anyway it is what it is it was like I think five dollars retail or four fifty something like that and then also a set of eyelashes um, that come with eyelash glue by the same company and I think these retailed for four dollars 
Um, so I don't mind getting a pair of eyelashes. They look fine. It looks like I, I will be able to wear them. I love my... Um, I almost never wear anything but my velour lashes now that I'm so spoiled by them, but I'll, I'm sure I'll wear that. So all in all, um, all the products, you know, $21, $7, $12, $4.50, $4, and then the bag, which it's hard to find a bag like that for less than $5. So, so I estimate that everything, probably I wouldn't have been able to purchase it for under like $55 to $60, like including tax. So um, again, I'm just like stoked by another month of Ipsy. So anyway, I just wanted to share that with you guys. Let me know if you have any questions about it or any comments. Leave them below. I love to hear from you guys. So I'll talk to you again soon. Bye.